My name is Karen Carterpa and I'm the clinical nurse manager in the general ward at Darwell Hospital. We don't have isolation facility in our general ward and also to separate out these patients from our general ward. So we looked at our spaces and we just rolled with our postnatal, our um, maternity postnatal beds and our postnatal clinic and antenatal clinic and then through into the detox unit. All our presentations are screened prior to coming into the building, um, whether it be by ambulance or they're presented in by private transport. The initial point of call is from the ambulance outside. There's a phone that rings that feeds through into the green zone um, and the patients get tested and screened there and then they're assessed as either potential respiratory with symptoms and directed to the red zone. Um, anyone else is then brought to the end of the green zone. Once we sorted out the, the zone was to how to keep it, that we could keep it clean. So I guess one of the major things was going through and putting the plastic all over the carpet. Um, we had one postnatal room with vinyl and the other one with carpet. So again, we did lots and lots of plastic overlay. And then again, when we realised that we needed more bed spaces through the detox unit, we also went through and did that area as well. We converted a recreational room and detox into a positive COVID confirmed two bed um, room. Um, sourcing oxygen supplies for rooms that didn't have piped oxygen setting up linen, setting up medication rooms, setting up a treatment room, setting up a recess room, sourcing ventilators, cardiac monitoring put in, being able to take that model and put it right through out the red zone as well so that we were able to cardiac monitor patients and have them visible from the general ward. So we've developed a full roster for the red zone, um, taken nurses from the general ward and got them working in red and we've got the HCAs from the detox unit working in the red zone as well to assist with the, um, the nurse down there and then we've moved the detox RNs down to work in the general ward to help cover the staffing gaps down there. Hello, how are you today? Staff that, that, you know, kicked in and did all the work and the maintenance. Guys, it was amazing, yeah. And the people that just moved were amazing too. The, the, mid, the midwives and the detox unit to, to just up and move and give us the space.